Come on, aren't you working? Work! Come on, work, damn it, come on! Nathan! Nathan! Nathan, can you hear me? Lucas! Lucas, is that you? Did you send someone else back in time you to tell me about? Well, who the hell else you think it is? Of course it's me. <sighs> thank God. Now thank him once you get the Nexus stable enough to bring me home. Your location, it isn't showing up on the Omni Suite. You're still not close enough to the time gate. There is a mob of angry British soldiers chasing me. Some are riding horses because they caught me trying to snag your sacred little relic. Did you? Did I what? Did you get it? No, I didn't get it. I don't remind you, these guys aren't playing around. I'm going to die if I don't get home now. There's nothing I can do. You're too far from the radius of the time gate. I told you, you could end up anywhere or anytime. Well, I'm doing crazier things on a Saturday night in Mississippi anyway. Here goes nothing. Lucas, no. You, you can end up anywhere. No, no, no. What are you doing? <laughs> Nathan. Nathan. Uh, hold on, I'm still trying to pinpoint your location. Uh, just like I thought. Yep, you're back. 19th century Europe. At least I lost them. Losing the soldiers was the least of your problems. Why is that? Because the wormhole that powers the time gate is on the cusp of shutting down. You need to get to its location now. Go! The time gate is still sustaining enough power, allowing me to track you in real time. Over that ridge! <sighs> How long? Give me a minute. It's still calculating. Lucas, just hold there for me. The uh, crew just powered up the transporter. Look, man. I know I could be a pain in the ass. There's no denying it. But your genius self found a way to send me back to 1801 Europe. <laughs> Talking to you in the future through this thing.
This is incredible. I wish you could see this. Uh, thanks, I think. Now get me home, because I've been here way too long. And I really miss my Vicky. Uh, can you hold for me real quick, Lucas? She did what? What? How would she even... What's wrong? Um, yeah, just, um, just another second there, buddy. Um, we had a little bit of a hold up. Something's wrong. I can hear your voice. Uh, yeah. Well, um, speaking of your wife, it seems that one of our interns thought it was a good idea to link her in to a direct feed from your Micron. So she could hear everything? You and I talking the whole time? That would be correct. Yes. <laughs> That's embarrassing. Uh, uh, honey, if you can hear me, I was just running from those soldiers so that I could get to you. That's all. Lucas, I'm going to get right to the point. Apparently, she snuck into the transporter after she heard that you were in danger. The time gate was up and running. She what? And uh, she's there with you now. She's here with me. Lucas, it's Captain Taylor. She's not with you. No, she's with me. Lucas, it's a trap. Don't. Vicky, Vicky. There's too many of them. Lucas. Nathan, you got the time gate powered up, right? Yes. Keep the gate open. We'll be right there. <laughs>